is what we're looking at now for for the uh, the Texans. Uh, we're kind of talk. Let's talk about what their their starting offense looks like. Um, you know, C.J. Stroud at quarterback. They bring over Mixon from the Bengals, um, who's no scrub. Is he still what he once was? Who knows? Who actually? I don't even know if it, if he even needs to be. He he he's a dual threat running back. He he really is. Um, very underrated running back. And then you got Pierce as well. You can use them both. Stephon Diggs joins now with Tank Dell and Nico Collins, who were already really good last year. Dalton Schultz over there at the tight end and Bobby Slowick running the OC. That's pretty damn impressive. That's pretty damn impressive. And we haven't even gone into the draft yet. And we haven't even touched the draft yet. Let me let me explain to you again what they what the Texans offense looks like. CJ Stroud going into his second year. Joe Mixon coming over from the Bengals. They needed to clear up some room. It made perfect sense. Texans had money. Uh, a lot of people don't realize Texans were they had a lot of money to spend. Not as much as us, but they were they had a lot. Uh, so again, CJ Stroud, Joe Mixon, Damian Pierce, Stefan Diggs, Tank Dell, Nico Collins, Dalton Schultz. Bob, uh, Bobby Slowick as the OC. That's crazy, bro. That's pretty crazy. You think about it. You know what I'm saying? Like that. That's some. What, like that's some offense right there. The the offensive lines uh, solid. Like it's. We're gonna need to bring it, because again, I call C.J. Stroud Jason Voorhees for a reason. You give him time, just like Jason Voorhees. You let Jason Voorhees catch you, you're done. He don't talk much, and CJ Shroud's not much of a talker either. He don't need to talk that much, but but if you give him time to throw, he's gonna bring out that machete and just unleash, bro. And that's what he's done. You got to get pressure on him. You have to, because he's Jason Voorhees out there, and that's coming from a Titans fan, bro. You got to keep it real, bro. The dude's a savage, and if we don't take care of business, he's gonna do what he did last year times two. We got to go and do what we do best and go and take it to him pause you got to go and get pressure you have to squad welcome back to the ta army bro um so you so look at that with, with cj stroud already doing everything that he's doing damian pierce is not a dual threat running back but he's a good at running back uh, joe mixon is more of a dual threat running back a little older but damian pierce will help him share the carries no issues uh, stefan diggs you know coming off of not his greatest season uh you know a lot of issues, a lot of issues, you know, always arguing when he doesn't get the ball, he's not happy, but everybody knows he's a good receiver. Everybody knows that. Is he still what he once was? I don't know. We'll see, but he's got, he's going to have every opportunity to shine here. This offense has a lot of weapons, a lot of weapons, you guys. So, uh, it's crazy. He brings that, that experience as well. Nico Collins and Tank Dale respectfully are, are younger, you know, he's going to even help them grow. And then Dalton Schultz, Schultz brings that, you know, reliability, good hands, good route running. It's like, God damn, man, they're going to they're gonna be a lot to deal with. And that's why Rand Carthon did what he did. He's like, look, we already know the Texans can throw. You, fuck, we must have, I mean, there was already rumors of these, these guys talking about this trade. This, char this trade was mentioned for a minute now between the Texans and the Bills. So Rand Carthon's sitting there like, fuck that. Colts, you you Walmart toilet seat logo happy horses. You guys ain't getting luxurious need. We're getting them because we got to defend the Texans. Y'all ain't even ready. You don't even know if your quarterback is a, is a running back, a quarterback, a slot receiver, a fucking defensive end. We don't even know what he is yet. We'll find out. But we needed more, we needed more secondary for sure. Roger McCreary, he's going to hold it down inside. And, and Legereus Sneed and Chido Chidobi Awuzie is going to hold on, uh, hold on the outsides, and we're going to see how we work. Let's go to work. Let's go to war, Texans. Everybody's already crowning them like they've already wrapped up the division. Let's see. Let's see. Let's play. Come on, man. We ain't we ain't handing out nothing for free. This ain't Girl Scout cookies. Come on, bro. Let's go to war, man. Yeah, you got a good offense. Yeah, we get that. But we do too. We do too. You know what I'm saying? We have Will Levis. You know what I'm saying? To your CJ Stroud. We have Ty J Spears to your Joe Mixon. We've we've got Tony Pollard to your Damian Pierce. Okay? We've got 
I mean, you could pick whatever receiver you want first. Let's just do out of respect. DeAndre Hopkins to your Stephon Diggs, right? I mean, and I know more, more is coming, but we could say the same for you. We're just comparing right now. Uh, Calvin Ridley to your Tank Dell. I mean, that's actually laughable. <laughs> no disrespect, bro. And then Nico Collins, Traylon Burks. So let's just say, come on, bro. Don't count us out. Chig and Josh Wiley together should equal Dalton Schultz. I'm just going to hope. I'm just going to hope so. And, and your OC, I don't give a damn about your OC. We got, we got Brian Callahan, baby. Come on. Look at that. Top of the dome. I'm just telling you, you guys. Don't sleep on my offense. Don't think that the Titans ain't going to be competing this year because we're coming. Tennessee Titans are coming too. So again, great, great, great offensive, uh, uh, you know, roster. For great offensive team for the for the for the Texans. That's insane. But ours is good too. Our receivers are better than the Texans. I want to see Will Levis versus CJ Stroud both going into this year as starters. Let's see who let's see who has a better year. Let's just see. Let's just see. Your offensive line's better for right now. I'll give you that. For right now. Oh man, people think we're so far behind. <laughs> How far are how far how far behind are we though? Let's let, let's be honest. How far behind are we? 